I am joined here with uh, my colleague from the uh, Senate House, uh, Rod Wright, uh, to introduce some very important guests. Uh, last year, Kelly uh, Anya Dyke uh, made her way into the Guinness Book of World Records on her 16th birthday by becoming the youngest African-American female to pilot four different fixed-wing aircrafts on the same day. This summer, Kelly's sister, 15-year-old Kimberly, became the youngest African-American female to pilot an airplane cross-country. Both young women were taught to fly by Robin Petgray, founder and director of Tomorrow's Aeronautical Museum, located in Compton, California. And interestingly enough, many young men and women, 13, 14, 15, are breaking world records flying back and forth across the country under the direction of Robin Petgrave uh, of Tomorrow's Aeronautical Museum, which he has received many congressional uh, accommodations in the United States House of Congress. These women were mentored by a very famed individual, Mr. Levi Thornhill, a member of the famed Tuskegee Airmen, who also joins us here today. We are also are joined by the Councilwoman of the great city of Compton, Lily Dobson. Members, please join me in welcoming these aspiring young women to the Assembly Four and help me congratulate them for their soaring accomplishments. Mrs. Onion DK, their, her, their mother, where's Miss, Un Miss DK, Onion DK? She's also here with us today. Let's welcome her as well. I think the Madam Speaker will have some words. Well, I just want to, I just want to join in congratulating the young women for what they have accomplished, and we will look forward to see you over these next few years because I'm sure there is much more to come. Thank you very much for your accomplishments.